Can you guess where we are? Probably not, but we're in Scotland. Yes, St. Ab's Head. Yes, which means it's time for an adventure. Another overnight adventure. And as you can see, I've got guests. I've got the, the girls out again with us um, for a coastal camp, our first one. So we're really looking forward to seeing what this place is all about. Views! Literally two minutes into the trip and we've already got some fantastic coastal views. So this is an absolute impromptu trip. We didn't plan on coming here at night. Um, we did plan on wild camping but we were going to go to the Lake District. Somehow ended up going in the complete opposite direction and decided that we would just spur the moment, come here and give this a go while the weather's nice. And I'm already glad that I did. Don't want to go down there. So this is a place that I've been looking at for a while now. And as much as I love the lakes, I just wanted to try something different. Just to say we've done a coastal camp, take that one off the list. And this is a, well, it's as good a place as any really, isn't it? I mean, look at it, stunning and shapes, colours and something completely different. I think I might be in the lakes on uh, Tuesday, possibly. So that's what I'm hoping for. So I thought, well tonight, let's get a bit coast and maybe, possibly, hopefully, get a sunrise in the morning. Shell picking. <laughs> so that is apparently Kirk Hill, and I think we're going up it by the looks of the map, but I'm not entirely sure where the path is, <laughs> so we'll have to have a look. Right, just because we're kind of running out of daylight and I just want a beer, um, we're just going to, we're going to pitch here. We've got some awesome views down to the lock and along the coast and obviously we're going to hopefully get a sunset, a uh, sunrise, sorry, in the morning. Fingers crossed, we're going to try and position the tents so we've got that view tonight of the sun going down, but also we're going to get the sunrise in the morning. So, uh, yeah, we start, uh, yeah, stick or twist, we're going to stick. This will do for the night. So um, I'm going to get the tents up now, I've got two to put up again. So what I'll do is I shall put you under some hypnosis and I'll bring you back when the tents are up. Three, two, one, you're under. Boom, back in the room. Both tents are up. We've got the Fjall Raven Abisco Light 2 for the girls and we've got the Lanshan um, 2 for me. So already this is only the second time i've used it but there's already a problem the little toggle off there like the loop the fabric loop just snapped off so that was crap the eye cat again the heathen the future skies i've never tried that at ultra fears he's leo hello. hello hi how's your tent it's nice how's your views it's nice how are you good Nice, <laughs> nice. <laughs> Well, rather than um, bring any jet boils and put on the 
uh, bag meals we've just brought sandwiches today. So that's all we're eating today. So no food reviews today. We're just chilling. Um, we've obviously everything. So we've had food, having a couple of just a couple of beers, nice and chilled. It's, it's a bit, it's a bit cold. The temperatures, um, it's a bit nippy like. But we've had, we've had my little drone, my little drone out, and Leila, the hound, was um, was chasing it all over. Emily just took some really, really funny pictures of it. So if uh, if I can get them onto the screen, I shall put them here now. <laughs> um, but yeah, she's uh, Leila's enjoyed herself <laughs> running around after the drone. Oh, I've been absolutely decked with tears, crying, laughing at the pictures that um, that, that <laughs> Emily's taken. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, so yeah, very very funny night. Oh, he scored, he scored, he's pulled tonight. Look at this sexy babe. What an absolute beaut. Silence of the lambs was incorrect. It wasn't factual. Just having um got the girls in behind. Woohoo! Uh, just having one more beer and then gonna get in the tent and uh get the little uko candle on, get the ambiance going and just chill. This is this it's actually colder than I expected tonight. I've obviously being next to the course with the, the open expanse before us is is having a bit of an impact on the temperature and the, the draft coming in is pretty breezy and pretty chilly. Question time. Did it? Did it? Did it? Did it? Did it? <laughs> <Duh. laughs> um, right, girls, what do you love about coming on these trips with me? The views. View. <laughs> no, do it. <laughs> what is this? No, the views. <laughs> what? What do you do? Views. Taking you to court for copyright. What do you love about coming on the trips with me? The views. Very, the copyright, very, so very. This. Ah, oh, ah. Oh, see, one of them says it. One of them said it. Fang sells. Um, she likes the views. She likes spending time with her dad. And you like pe pinching people's scenes, don't you, Emily? Little drone. <gasps> what is? Right, so Ellie's in her tent, but I've been joined in my tent by my little Emily. So uh, we are, are chilling, having some dad and daughter time. <laughs> See how we get on. Are you licking the mat? <laughs> I'm only here during the night, you know. Listen. What? Doing a beer review here, you know. <laughs> no, um, it's actually very nice. Very, very nice. First taste, anyway. Very citrusy. Um, quite a nice aftertaste. Aftertaste. So yeah, pretty good. Cheers, everybody. The old girl is tired. It's about time to go to bed, so I'm going to say goodnight to you. 
unless something diabolical happens during the night. I see them on. Good night. You'll stay on my mind. You'll stay on my mind. Since you came to me, my life has changed. Bad things will be gone, the good remains. I will walk this world We'll walk this world With you I Will walk this world We'll walk this world So far. Good morning. We've um, we've woke up bang on time for uh, sunrise, and as you can see, it's an absolutely unbelievable uh, view out towards the horizon with the sun sitting just above the water. Some little guy in a boat also joined us. Um, sunrise was at like 4:48, and I woke up bang on to the minute, like no alarm, just completely by chance. Um, I checked last night to see what time it was, so it must have been in me, in me um, subliminal body, col body clock. Um, but yeah, like, look at that, man. Such a fantastic, fantastic view. It's, um, it's really, it's really still as well this morning, really still. There's not a breath of wind and it looks like it's going to be an amazing day up in Scotland, up in Bonnie, Scotland. Right, it's, uh, we're going to take the tents down and we're just going to start making our way back. It's super early, but we're going to have a look along the cliff uh, before we go back to the car. So, let's do a bit of time travelling and I'll bring you back soon. Boom, back in the present, tents are gone. Leave no trace. So, just a little bit of flat grass. Remember, always leave no trace. Leave no trace, non trace left. Let's go, we're off, back off to the car, we're gonna walk along the cliffs and have a have a little look, and then uh, then just make our way back. So, what an amazing morning. It's, it's really warm as well today, really warm. So we've definitely picked a good morning to wake up to.
definitely don't want to go down there. So one of the disappointing things uh, of the camp was the air mask that Emily was using, which was the Exped Dura 8 regular. Um, it's deflated during the night, so I'm going to have to check that out when I get back to see if there's, we'll see where the puncture is. Not something you would really expect from a mat of such price. <sighs> we've, right, we've only, I mean, I've only had it since October, so we've probably used it maybe a dozen times. So you wouldn't really expect a mat of that supposed quality to go down um, or have any issues after such a short period of time but yeah we'll have to look into that when I get back very disappointing And that is where we were camping on top of that's I think Kirk Hill it's called so we were camping just on the top of it up there just seeing another wild camper as well um, a little bit further down and then looking out Well, we're nearly back at the car, so this is as good a place as any to sign off with the sun behind us and the cliffs and the ocean. It's been amazing, like, it's absolutely fantastic little spot up here. So, we're, we're glad that we've come and tried our first coastal camp. Have you enjoyed it, girls? Mm -hmm. So, um, hi, as always, thank you for watching, and uh, yeah, we'll be back out soon. Bye for now.